What if I told you there was a way to take your competitors' questions and use them on your website? Let me show you how. Watch this. I dedicate this video to Darren Marion. I love you, brother. All right, guys. Hope everybody's doing great. That was an eerie beginning, right? I'm doing it for uh, Halloween. Doing it up for Halloween. All right. So, guys, if you're watching this video, you're trying to rank here. You're trying to rank on Google Maps, and it's getting harder. It's getting harder and harder. So, I, I have to come up with different methods for you because I want you to rank. I make these videos for you so you could do this yourself. Naturally, if you don't have the time, you could reach out to me. I'd be happy to help you with it. But I, I give you everything I, I have. Everything I know, I give to you so you could do it yourself, right? You don't have to hire a guy like me, right? You could do it yourself. I'm going to give you all the information. So today I want to speak to you about... So your clients are getting a bunch of questions asked by their clients. And they're answering them, right? But we want to show Google that you're the expert in your industry, whether you're a roofer or electrician, plumber or dentist, right? So the way, I'm gonna show you the way to do it. It's really very simple, but um, let's do this together. It's gonna be a lot of fun. All right, guys. All right, guys, so it's super simple. This is what we're going to do, super simple. So uh, I'm coming over here to Everyday Plumber. I am just, clicked their name and on the right hand side you'll notice questions and answers by the way google is uh removing this feature so uh it's a good idea to do this now they're replacing it with ask maps i think somewhere in november around november 5th so now's a good time to do what i'm going to show you so you'll notice that i think i did that a little quick let me do that again for you so i will click a category you could click any one you want i just happened to click this because i saw before he had 14 reviews so i click the reviews right i scroll down i look for the reviews and then i copy just like this all the reviews now to save time i already did it i copy it and then i write up a, a, a prompt which i'm going to put in the description below please create an s SEO optimized blog page based on my competitors Q and A's. If the Q and A mentions a brand, please replace it with my brand, ABC plumbing. I just made that up. Whatever you name your business is, if you're a roofer, if you're an electrician or, you know, you're a contractor, whatever you, you know, you get the idea. Please use charts and graphs when creating this page. That's something that's very important. Google loves to rank pages that have charts and graphs in them. So, you know, tell, tell, um, chat GPT to create that. Right. And, uh, uh, make, make it easier to digest the, the charts and graphs have make it easier to adjust in Google rank. Now, also one of the other things that you could put in is, uh, add in, add in keywords or head it, add in my neighborhood. Right. So, I'll put the full prompt in the description in the description below, but I just want to show you what it did. So I, I put in all the, I copy and pasted all the reviews from this client, right? And then it gave me, it gave me everything I needed. So here is the um, fully SEO optimized blog page. Page title, Tampa Bay Plumbing Service, expert answers from ABC Plumbing. I said that I was ABC Plumbing, right? So I said, anytime they mention whatever that other plumbing company was, just replace it with my name, right? And uh, it, it gave the meta description. It also gives, uh, it gives the full blog, right? And I'll show you here. This is what we're looking for, right? Uh, most popular fixture brands in Tampa Bay, Moen, Delta, Cola, Toto, American Standard, right? So you want to see these charts and everything in there. So I'm going to put the link in the description below with the, with the, um, the prompt that I use. And I hope that this helps you rank. I do believe the first week in November, they're going to remove, Google's going to remove this feature. Uh, right here called question answers. I think it's going to be called ask maps somewhere around November 5th or so. So get these questions. Now you could also grab questions here and you could go to this business. So you got 14 questions here, 
open up a sheet, grab three from this guy, right? Grab from this person. You could grab, if they have any, yeah, here, three questions and answers, right? And you get a whole long list of questions and answers. And what this is going to show Google is that you're the expert in your area. For any question that somebody has, you have the answer for. So that is a neat way to rank. I hope this video helps you. I try to create videos that, uh, things that you could do yourself, right? That you don't need to pay somebody to do if you're, you know, I always, I always, I always do videos for my younger self. I always say, hey, what would I have wanted from somebody when I was struggling, right? When I was a brand new business owner, what would I have wanted somebody to create? I, for me, it was always, I want somebody to create something that I could do and you don't need a PhD to understand. Copy and paste the reviews, put it in chat GPT with this little prompt and then take that content and put it on your website. Couldn't be any easier. Don't go crazy with this, meaning don't add 20 pages of blog page content in a day, right? Google knows that it's easy to create content right now. Google does not want to uh, take space on their servers by you posting, you know, 20 articles a day because it's easy to post content now, right? Especially if you've had the website for a long time, you have a 10 page website, now all of a sudden you're posting 20 pages a day, right? So try you go 10 pages a month right somewhere around there for for a small business every business is different but just just get the general idea of what i'm trying to say i hope this video helped you right i make these videos so you could help your family and you could grow and you could make more money you could have fun with your kids and you know you can enjoy you know your, your day off or your days off if you're lucky enough to have that couple of days off with your family so be good be good to your family even while even while you're struggling right be good to your family take out the dog take out the garbage sweep vacuum right do the stuff around the house every once in a while get up from your chair i know this is i know you worked a full day and now you're trying to figure out seo now you got an seo guy telling you to you know to clean up around the house but you have to do that you have to do that because you're just going to be you're just going to be seen as a guy who works all the time right there's no winning. You work all the time, you make the money, and, and they're mad at you for that. And you don't work, you don't make any money. So listen, you gotta, <laughs> you know, if you're married, you know, right? So that's it. All right, guys, everybody have a great day, and we will see you tomorrow. Boop, boop, boop.